hi welcome back to my channel don't forget to like and subscribe but leave a comment down below what you'd like to see next today i'll be making a hive wing and um you may notice um that i'm not using a base like last time that's because uh, i i worked up the confidence to not use the base so oh my god i'm gonna go next um, I went back and forth deciding if I wanted to do just the neck and up or the whole body. In the end, I decided just to do the neck and up. And, um, I did end up, um, choosing, yeah, um, to do just the neck up because I just, I'm really bad at drawing at them in general but i can't do feet i can't do feet or bodies or wings at all but um anyway i ended up making the ears kind of look like shrekulous hopefully no one noticed of course they're gonna notice now because i said it <laughs> oh but like imagine this character saying get out of my swamp donkey <laughs> You'd have to say it in, like, an Australian accent, because that's kind of the accent I picture him with. I'll do, um, what I think his voice would sound like at the end. Yeah, but until then, um, I put some stripe patterns in. I don't know why. I think I thought it might give more texture. And, um, I wanted to make the eyes seem more like honeycomb. But you know what I mean? I also may have noticed I used a lot of ombre. I wanted to add a lot more color. And now I'm going to add like a pouch so then he can hold pollen and honey and food and anything else he might need. Um, I went back and forth debating on how many to give him. And in the end, I decided on three. Yeah, and I also went back and forth with as if the strap should be rope or um, leaf. I did end up going with leaf, as you can see. But, yeah. And then here's the honey that he's got stored up. And um, you're gonna notice I'm gonna take away and put the eyes back a bunch of times. You will see why later. But anyway, he's a very kind, but very um, shy. And the introverted character. He also has a lot of jewelry because that, um, I don't know yet. I might see the back going on and there might be a purpose, but he wears a lot of jewelry. And, and uh, um, I thought that he might not live in the hive. He might live just outside of it because he was exiled, maybe. He also has terrible vision. And, um, he ends up bumping into things a lot. And the eyes can move. See? Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment down below what you'd like to see next. Hope you enjoyed. Bye! Good day, mate. Anything I can help you with today?